what what happens next? Like I I laid it out and we heard from Pascal Vincent off the, off the top of the show and he sort of explained um, why he scratched him, but uh, healthy scratched him. What happens now, Elliot? Beginning of a new week here. Look, I, I think ultimately they're going to put him back into the lineup and, and just try to make it work. Uh, you know, there's not really much else you can do unless you're going to trade him or you're going to bench him some more. Um, you know, all you can really do is say, uh, hey, um, you know, we said we'd have you sit out and we're going to put you back in and hopefully things are going to figure themselves back out and, you know, he'll get the reset that he needs. But, um, you know, like just clearly like thinking more about it, I, I think there's probably some big picture questions going on for Columbus right now. Um, you know, Jeff, as we talked about on Friday and then on the pod this morning, and I've mentioned it again now, um, you, you know, whatever Columbus is trying here in terms of we're doing the benchings, we're, you know, we're trying to um, show people that things are, are going to be different um, it's it's not the message isn't getting through um, because it keeps happening, right? So you know, mm. obviously, obviously, whatever you're trying to accomplish, it's just not going as well as you would hope. And you know, now too, I mean, you don't you don't give up on your season, but the math is not Columbus's friend, so. You know, I, I think we're all kind of wondering here, where is the next, like, where is this going? Are, is Columbus going to try to change their mix? Um, you know, I, I definitely think there's, you know, long-term consequences here in the sense that the organization is going to have some big decisions to make. Are we talking off ice? Are we talking on ice? Um, are you they going to continue just taking people in and out of the lineup? I think you have to have some big conversations about what you're doing. I think when it comes to line A2, and you know, we've got to be honest about this, he hasn't been very good. Like, it, like that's the one thing that I think has to be pointed out here. If you've watched him lately, he hasn't been very good. But, Jeff, is he a center? Is he a winger? You know, we talked on the pod this morning about how my thing was, you have to put him back on the wing. If it's not working at center, put him back on the wing. Someone called me this morning and said he did go back to the wing. I said, I know it was just for a game or two. Like you got to, and, and plus he was also hurt. Like you've got to commit to the wing for line A now. Just decide where is he best off playing and put him back in that position. You know, the other thing too, I didn't even realize this, but someone pointed out to me today, Columbus, I think had five power plays last night against Philly. And I don't think they had a shot on goal. Like, get lining on your power play in a spot that'll make him feel good. And I think that's the thing you have to do is, um, you know, line has got to be better arguing that, but he has to be put into a position where he can succeed. 